my mom, he killed my mom. He shot her in the head. She's dead. And she said, my little sister in there, she's five. Mm, heartbreaking words. Two deadly shootings, one on each side of the river, leave three children and one woman dead. It was a violent, very sad night leading up to the 4th of July in the St. Louis region. That's right. Two shootings, leaving four people dead. A 10-year-old child was shot and killed in Belleville. And a mother and two of her three children were killed in St. Anne. Our Russell Kinsall has been looking into both of these cases all day and has the very latest now from St. Anne. Well, I just spoke with St. Anne Police Chief Aaron Jimenez. He gave me the very latest on the investigation. It was a murder-suicide that happened in this White House right behind me here on Jane Avenue. He told me it was 34-year-old Coleman McIlvain, Coleman McIlvain, who is the name of the person who shot and killed his girlfriend and killed two of her children before killing himself. Neighbors say the couple living in the home fought a lot, and last night they say there were gunshots heard from inside the home around 8 p.m. Actually, though, earlier in the evening, neighbors say the couple seemed to be preparing for a 4th of July celebration in the backyard, but police say last night there was an argument that turned violent. Uh, that argument, apparently the girlfriend was trying to convince McElvain that he'd been drinking and shouldn't leave and go driving in a car. Police say after that argument, he shot the girlfriend then shot and killed a 14-year-old boy and a 5-year-old girl, but that a 9-year-old girl was able to escape to a neighbor's and survived. The daughter then observed uh, the boyfriend shoot her mom in the face and then had that fight or flight response. She chose to obviously flee. Did, did, I, her wits are amazing to have those to know that you need to get out of there. And he fired approximately seven shots to try to kill her. He struck her in the left hand with uh, one bullet. Now in Belleville, police were called to a home on Roosevelt Avenue around 10 p.m. We're told a 10-year-old boy was inside a home with a gunshot wound. The major case squad was called in to investigate his death. We talked with neighbors who said the boy was friendly and had a good sense of humor. Neighbors, though, were very upset about his death. Oh, my God, because I'm, I'm just tired of them. They killing kids. So who, somebody, you know, who, I'm just upset right now. So we spoke in Belleville. We spoke with a neighbor whose son went to school with and played with that boy who was shot and killed. You're going to hear from that young man talking about his friend. And here in St. Anne, we talked with a neighbor who is a nurse who rendered aid and comfort to uh, the child that was shot but survived and ran to a neighbor's house. You're going to hear from her talking about taking care of that young girl until paramedics and police arrived. That's coming up on News 4 at 5. Live in St. Anne, Russell Kinsall, News 4. Russell,